Mustafa. Perth is on the far post. Power may well have been trying to turn it behind for the corner. It went in Corrigan's direction, but he couldn't stop it going out. Mountford is nine for Halifax. Just in front of him, five is Harris. Dipping all the way, and it's hit the post. And it went all the way across Corrigan and came out off the post. You can see rain falling, which can only make conditions worse. Had there have been a lot of rain this morning, there's no doubt that the game wouldn't have been played. Power. Here's Shinton. George Kirby has been so quick to praise John Kilner's performances this season. And the young goalkeeper at his most alert as Shinton flicked on Powers Cross and fine handling of the greasy ball. Bennett. Peyton going on. Certainly nothing defensive about City today. And here's Robinson. Beaten away. Kilner, Bennett driving it back. Away by Harris. Oh, fine reflexes from Kilner again. And Kennedy, who was born in Manchester. But sees himself as a Manchester United fan, so there's an extra incentive to try and put one over on City. Well, we're right in there, and Perth and Evans both swinging at it, and Corrigan having to make the save. So Halifax again congregate on the near post. Kennedy looking for Harris. Henry. Henry with a second chance. Well, that is a well-rehearsed ploy, looking for Harris at the near post. He caused the confusion, and Hendry had two bites at it. The first one was blocked away by Robinson, and the second one, under pressure, went wide. It's a style of play that has served Halifax well in the fourth division. They play with three men in midfield and pull their flank men back to augment that. Makes them a difficult side to beat. But in the last quarter of an hour here at Lachey, they've really got to be looking for a winning goal. And perhaps Henry has found it. Well, it came right on cue. From Paul Henry. And Lachey erupts in delight. Stafford drilled it in. Made it off. And Henry keeping his balance, the smallest player on the field, tucked it into the corner. Peyton struck Robinson. And Daly. Well, it was so close for Manchester City, Malcolm Allison and Steve Daly. Kilner was beaten. Shinton. But he's certainly not giving up without a fight. The referees looked at the watch. George Kirby out of the dugout. He knows that there's precious few seconds left. And he knows that it's over. Halifax come up with a upset at the shave.